everybody, Susan here from Allegheny Roots, and this is uh, Amish Country Vlog number one, uh, getting ready to leave and packing up, so prep day plus travel day. So today is... Um, Tuesday? Today's Tuesday. I'm just getting home. I stopped and picked up our snacks and drinks for the week. Um, it is a yucky day here. Let me show you. It is raining. It is yucky. It's The wind is blowing today. You can't really see that right now but there's like, it's gusty out. Um, it is very chilly, 53 degrees. But the show must go on and we must continue to get ready. So I have to unload um, the groceries. I'm gonna leave the water in my car. Uh, let's get the stuff out of the car and um, I'm gonna be taking you guys with me today and tomorrow while I pack up and get ready and uh, start our travel time. So let's get the stuff out of the car. Oh, wow. All right. So the lady who loaded my groceries. I get she had to do it in the rain. That was no fun. But come on. The top fell on the. Yeah. Well, anyway. Fell on my buns. So some of this is groceries for us. Some of it is groceries for my husband. All of it is for the next few days. It's gonna time to get it inside and get it unloaded. Okay, so I have. I think I have the snack box all packed up. I have my electric tea kettle for my um, for my tea that I make every day. I also threw in a box of sleepy time tea in case anybody needs a warm me up um, or needs help sleeping. Got some peanuts here, some skinny pop popcorn, two bags because that's always popular. Um, my mom's bringing the chocolate. I've got some paper towels here in case we need them at the cabin. And also I have Dawn Power Wash that I packed because a couple of years ago we stayed at a cabin and there wasn't any dish soap or anything like that to wash our dishes with. So, <clears throat> excuse me. So now I always bring a thing of Dawn Power Wash um, just just in case we need it. So thankfully last year when I brought it, we didn't need it at all. And also you never know if things like paper towels are going to be provided. So I went ahead and threw that in there too. So now I'm ready to go throw this stuff into the car. Okay. And go ahead and just put this in the back seat. Wish I would have had time to have my my car detailed before we left, but it's fine. It's just my mom and me riding in here. So I go ahead and put stuff in the car because I know me and I know that I will not um, be running on time tomorrow. <laughs> There's no way I will be. So I pack as much into the car um, or pack as much stuff up as I can the day before. Um, and so this stuff will be fine in the car overnight.
the next day. <sighs> uh, hi guys. So, it's travel day. I have a lot of stuff I have to get done. Um, I'm not much of a traveler. I'm more of a homebody. So, I have to um, install this puppy on my dashboard to hold my phone because my car does not have navigation. Today, um, I still have to pack. I haven't done any of that stuff. <laughs> I'm like, I haven't gotten ready yet. Obviously, I'm not wearing any makeup at all. My hair's not done. I need to run up to um, Dollar General to get some travel items, travel sized items. I know I should have done that like a week ago, but it just occurred to me last night that I need to do that. So um, anyway, yeah, let's get this puppy installed. So first I have to decide where I'm gonna put it. So my dash isn't really very well designed for one of these things. Um, I know most people put them like right here. I thought about putting mine over here, um, but I'm also afraid it's going to be um, in my way, maybe, my line of sight. Um, so I'm thinking about putting it here. The only bad thing is I need more of a flat surface and this is curved, but this is more flat, but also it's also a little cubby hole, which is where I, where I keep my extra sunglasses in case I forget my sunglasses. I'm not planning on forgetting my sunglasses though, so I don't think I'll need my extra sunglasses. So I'm kind of thinking that I'll put it right there. So I really think I'm still going to have to put it on top of that little door cubby thingy because if I put it over here, then the cord is going to have to go across my, um, you know, whatever those are called. <laughs> so I think I'm gonna have to put it there. Ah, okay. I didn't wanna have to put it on top of that, on top of this cubby thing, but I'm gonna have to. Okay, so it came with these little wipe things. So first I have to wipe it down with this one and then this one before I can put the little sticky thing down. So I'm gonna do that. Next I'm supposed to peel this bottom thing off and then stick it up here and then turn this bottom part at the base to lock it in place. Okay, and it's done. It's in there. This like locking it into place thing turned a little harder than I thought it would. Um, maybe that's a good thing. Maybe it's really locked in there. Um, so I hope this is where I want it because this is where it is. It's on there really good too. So bonus with this moved all the way down. Look, I can still reach into my little cubby hole if I need to. Hot dog. Perfect. Okay. I'm ready to start packing. Oh my. Can you tell I don't go very many places. My luggage is very, <laughs> very dusty and um, it's old. Look, I don't even have the four wheel type luggage. I only have the two wheel type luggage. Um, it's very, very old. Um, it's like 20 years old. So I'm going to start packing. Okay, so we are all, well, I am all packed up. I'm ready to go, ready to roll, uh, ready to get on out of here. Um, but I'm waiting on the rest of the crew to get here. And uh, I just uh, had a text message that they are running late. So I had gone ahead and come on out to the car to start getting it cooled down because it's a black car and the sun is hot even though it's not overly warm outside so um but they're not here yet and they're waiting 
They're waiting on my one sister to get back to the house so they can leave and um, come on over. And we're gonna transfer my mom into my vehicle and then we're going to go head on up to Amish country. Um, yeah, we'll see you when we get to the cabin. Yay!